since they added a new car extract for shoreline there's ground zero and all that i want to get four at least four uses on every single map to get my scav rep up to like i think it was like 5.6 which is crazy but um yeah, that's what I'm going to do, basically. Money's kind of annoying right now. I don't know why. I just I keep dying. So it's like, might as well try to get my scab to get some good gear on him. What level am I? 2.6. Yeah, and that was literally just like barely under one. And I was doing this a bit before, but now I'm going to do it on recording. I'm going to scab first to get some loot. There we go. Lives card, all right. See, I mean, like, getting the scab rep is worth it just for that, because that already by itself is worth a good amount, you know? I hate that helmet. Actually, what is it now? Because it's... Napiers. Oh, level one. I mean, that's just worthless. So, with the addition to this wipe, you know, like everything they changed, adding those two car extracts, vaulting, Brico will change. There are going to be some issues. And I'm guarantee that there's going to be a lot of vault spots where you're not supposed to be, and there's going to be a lot of glitches. Like, already we're seeing stuff at Resort and on Streets of Tarkov. I'm actually going to show you the one that's on Streets. It's like right in the middle where all the industrial spawn is. There's a marked room. You can get it before, yeah, you could just like walk backwards into it, but now you can actually just straight up hop into it through the window. I've also noticed a spot that I found myself, and uh, other people are seeing it too, it's not that like hidden of a spot, it's actually pretty obvious once you see it. But on ground zero, you know, you do that quest to do the um, saving the molar thing, I think that's what it's called, and uh, you have to get the scientist key, go up, get grab the hard drive, find the USEC people that are dead. That key? Sure, you have to go there for the quest, but like if you want into that room where the key unlocks, I think it's like room number three when you go up the stairs to the right, you're able to actually just hop over one of the desks in the room next to it, go inside there on the computer desks that are next to the window. You can just hop on that and then go all the way around. You don't actually have to use the key. So if you're doing that quest and the key doesn't spawn, just go ahead and hop around it. So all you have to do is go up next to the scientists. You don't actually need to do any crazy stuff. Ooh, what the fuck? I'll take that. Wow. Five front, back, left, and right, and then two on everything else. That's insane. Oh yeah, I forgot they um, added the APC, or BMC, BP, ABCs, the tank that drives around on streets. That's cool. I haven't actually used it yet, because I don't ever bring that much rubles in, but that's crazy. I think it's like 40,000. You can put a whole, like, three by, I don't know, eight? I don't know for sure what it is. No, four by eight. Something like that into your stash. Like, I might just farm streets for my quest items just because of that insurance. Streets of Tarkov, you know, these are the industrial buildings right in the middle of the map. And then this railing here, you can hop up on the top of it. It's kind of finicky to go out from the right side a little bit, I've noticed. Yeah. And then you walk up it, go up to the corner, walk around, jump on this little ledge. And then this window here, once you jump up on the side, you kind of have to look left to hop on. And then while sprinting, you have to jump that. There you go. Don't jump actually, sorry. Vaults. Everything you do is vault. You don't jump once. And you're able to get in here. Not the best loot. It's honestly one of the worst, the marked rooms, but somebody else honestly might have gotten this to this before me. Because that's crazy. But yeah, once you're in, you want to get out. You can't really go through the store. Need a key. You can go through the ceiling. And if you want to leave, you can hop on top of this camera and then hop on top of the shelves. And then you can like vault on this box. And for some reason, you vault up. So like this. Up on the camera. Sometimes it's weird jumping there. And then here, that's easy. And then you just look in the corner and vault. Really easy. Actually crazy. Like it's, you know, like in the old days with Call of Duty, you're trying to like vault into these, um, vault. Wow. You're trying to jump into these, all these glitch spots out of the map, yada, yada. That stuff would be like tedious as fuck. Like you'd be jumping for hours thinking they patched it and eventually you'll get it. And that's not just me, but I'd love to doing that stuff. But yeah, that jump spot into the marked room, that, that's getting more popular. At first, no one was really there. Now everyone's in there. It's always eluded. What do you mean? Might as well try your chances with it instead of actually buying one of those keys. It's an empty raid. No one's here. Usually I'll just sell all unless I need something for a quest. I think I have the beard. No, I don't. I have all the Tatankers. Keep the lab card. Sell all this. The... I'll keep these because I don't remember which one you need for a quest. And the matches. I need the bulb. Sell the rest. I earned 69,000 rubles. That was worth it. Not gonna take much when I'm doing these car extracts, like literally this shitty pistol and then ammo in my pouch so I don't waste it. I have these meds and all this equipment because I killed a guy while trying to do this and I just took all his stuff. But yeah, 
and we have a little tally mark. I'm going to do four on each map. You can tell how much you've done if you haven't been keeping track. If Whenever you do extract, so like the equation to know how much you've done, it's 0.4 divided by how many runs you've done, and that equals your XP you get. So if you want to set up a little equation, 0.4 divided by X equals whatever XP you got, and then that's the number that you've used the car extract, if you need to know that. Always make sure you have rubles, because I keep forgetting. So I'm going to bring a lot of just extra rubles. And I'm going to go shoreline. I feel like not many people would be at shoreline right now. If they are, it's just in the main building. I don't think people know so much that there's a new car extract there. Unless I'm stupid, but I swear to God I saw that there's a car extract on the top right of the map. But I haven't seen anyone talk about it, so I'm going to make sure that's actually there. It's not even on the maps that I use. Yeah. So right here, this is the, um, just close OBS. Kind of an updated map. It's really makeshift. They kind of just threw this on there. There's this whole new farmland, I guess, in between this corner of the map, and then the vehicle extract is here behind these buildings. I know there's like a fence here, and then there's a little road that goes outwards, and that's where the extract is. But yeah, it's up there. So I'm not crazy. I guess it is real. The fuck am I? Am I next to it? Where's this? Oh, wait a minute. Oh, no. The resort should be up there. Yeah, that's it. Cool. Road to North V exit. Oh, yeah. So it is real. Were these power towers here before? I don't think so. Yeah, that was the farmland. That's all new. I didn't think it was this close. So it's literally kind of not even on the corner. It's on the, the side of it. I don't want to explore it before I extract. Is that a player? This, that's gotta be a scab. I'm not gonna try shooting that. This gun is so weird. I bought it because it was really cheap and I just had the ammo for it. I died so many times trying to go to ve vehicle extract. Damn, this is actually huge. I thought it was like a little farm. There's a mounted gun! I wonder if I can see that from up there. No. Okay, buddy. Do I have to aim at- Okay, I got him. Dude, this pistol annoys me. Like, that should have- Unless it was bouncing off his helmet. He had a good helmet for these shitty pistol bullets. There was another scav here on the other side. Unless I was a player. Which I hope not. Oh shit, I forgot I have armor. Uh, that's insured, I guess. Oh. I sounded a lot closer. Okay. This is the same building from Zerv. I mean, different interior. I don't care if it's the same outer building. Dude, if it was a copy, I would have been pissed. <laughs> oh, LCD. I thought it was a whole laptop. Another? Yeah. I don't know what I'm doing. Just want to explore. <laughs> so it should be... Not that way. Man, that is open for an extract! If it's been taken? No. Screw it. Dude, this is so open. I don't like this. It's a fence to the right, so you can't even go around. Yes, I know there's a here. Come on. Oh, that's actually pretty good. Drop, 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 drop. Uh, drop. Uh, keep the rest. Pop over this little box. Up again. Screwdriver spawn for some reason. Oh, uh, that's good too. Fuck. My meds. And here's the car. What? How do you... Oh, here it is. Go to the side to do it. If you go anywhere in front of the car, it's a sniper. Which, I mean, that's every car. If it's open like that. Climber's Trail? That's also a new one. I didn't even realize that. Where is that at? I gotta look at that map again. I don't think any players coming up. I'm gonna look it up now. Oh, so it's, um, I'll show you. So when you're, so I just did the vehicle extract. It's like somewhere over here. This map, I don't know if the proportions are right. I feel like this got expanded a little more. But anyways, so where this scav kind of place used to be, old bunker, I thought that was more here. But anyways, yeah, just up the road. You need a paracord and a red rebel to get it, use it. That's nice. They added more uses for it. And that is insane, actually. Because you used to have to like, run so far away to extract, now you can just go there. That's crazy. That's extremely useful, but also crazy, because like, high-level people, they're going to loot that and leave right away. It's good money. The resort. And also, there's a lot of PvP missions there, too, so that's nice to just leave right away. I'm do Lighthouse now. I'm going to switch maps every time. Still have a beard. I should sell that. That's, that's actually not worth taking in. Never mind, I have a scav run. I'm just going to use that instead. Streets. See if we can get that spot again. And we're in. 
big flashlight. Man, I can't see anything with this on. There we go. Oh, I wonder if the bosses are here. Actually, hold on. Can I even go through here? That There's a way to do it from back here. I can't remember how because I keep dying. I've tried it so many times now. Actually, I don't think you can go through here. Yeah, that's that's a dead end. I'm not testing that. I wonder if you could hop up there now. Oh, that's got to be possible. Grab the ledge, you know. I could probably just jump that. I don't know why I'm trying to vault only. Yep. I think I can open that door. Yeah, I can even get to that door. Yeah, it's not a Claymore's work. I forgot. Probably... Which way is it facing? Facing my direction. Or... I don't think it matters by the Claymore's direction, though. Nope! Ah, I knew it! I don't even know if you could use that door. I've never tried. It was worth the try. Alright, we're gonna go lighthouse. Wait, am I supposed to get rid of this? This? Because I could just sell those. I don't know why I'd want to keep on. Okay. Lighthouse. Not bad. Oh, I'm a bear! I chose bear! I hope it doesn't just... I've never played bear on lighthouse before. I hope all those um, rogues don't just shoot me right away. I'm gonna cross the bridge. I'm not going on the right side by cabins. Oh, that. That's assuming I'm even gonna live this section. Sometimes the player spawns closer. I wonder if you can kill rogues with this. Oh, okay. Keep running. Why am I freaking out? Who the fuck was shooting me? Somebody else is shooting me. No way he sees me! Dude, they hate bears. That's insane! They can see you through these trees? I don't know if I'll be able to cross bridge then. I always thought it was like safe. But I always did as a USEC. Oh, I'm fucked, I'm fucked, I'm fucked. I'm good. I'm good. This is definitely one of the riskier ways to get to it. Can they see you from here? Oh shit, yeah, they can. I wonder if I can see him. Yeah, I can't see shit. Oh, actually, it's that one. I mean, either way, if I cross, he won't see me. And somebody else is shooting at them. I might just cross and go into the sand. So I can see him. No, I doubt it. I'm just gonna run. We're safe. We're safe. I should have brought a Mosin or something with the scope. This map needs it. Can you see me with the gun? I... Shit. Has that boat always been there? I do not remember that boat. I don't remember that boat being there. Eh, I don't know. Maybe I'm weird. I swear I've never seen that boat before. Once you're at these pipes, you're like halfway. That dock there is pretty much where you turn right. I mean, you could always tell by going on the right side, but if you want to like hug left, this is where you would turn. No shots! You can't hit this! Dun, 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 dun. Come on, stand up, motherfucker. Why are you laying down? Stop laying down! Oh my god. I want to prone and heal my leg. Oh shit, that's a lot. I'm, I'm just gonna med. There's like three scabs. Are you kidding? Oh, this is the most inaccurate thing in the world. I swear to god that should hit. By the way, if you ever use this pistol, it's faster to put it in your pocket and reload it that way. Saves you a lot of time. Okay, buddy, don't fucking peek out of nowhere with the shotgun. Hello? Jesus, man. We're cool. We got them all. You had a pilgrim, didn't you? Oh yeah. And a zook. Wow. Like, a lot of scabs are having this big mag SKS. I like it. I don't even know if there's loot in here. I just want to check it out again. Kind of surprised there's nothing really in here. I'm gonna heal my leg, actually. Well, oh, that's a crate. I didn't know there's a crate up here. Bet this is never looted. I sworn I heard footsteps. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh shit. Ow. No one's on the gun. We're good. I hope. Is that a fucking player? What is that? That was a player for sure, right? Yeah, it is. Fuck, I wish I had an S scope. You know, like, ba 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 ba. I don't want to run over there yet because he might see me. Actually, I don't know if that is a player. Why would they be doing that? Yeah, there's no way that's a player. 
I don't want to go down there and kill it. But I want to take the car out track. Wait, is there no car? How far back is it? Shouldn't it be just right here? It doesn't spawn all the time. Unless it's just here. I don't know how far back it is. I don't want to get shot. I feel like this sandbags is where it's at. But that wouldn't make sense for a car to be there. But it wouldn't make sense to be back there, because that's sketchy as hell. Oh, yeah, it's supposed to be right here. Damn it! Uh, dude, farming car tracks is not easy. That shit takes forever. All these videos out there make it sound like it's going to take a day. Maybe two. They're like, oh, you can quickly farm all five, you know, get up. <laughs> it's not, not easy at all. I'm going to kill that. Man, the way he's moving is so weird. Like, he's ADing. I think it might have been players fighting and they were just being fucking weird, I don't know. Oh yeah, I don't think they close doors, do they? I don't think they close doors. I have enough loot, it's kinda shit loot, but it's enough. Oh yeah, there's a dead dude there. That was a player. He wasn't there before. I didn't hear any gunshots. Sledgehammer. It's worth more than an AK, I think. It's not even an AK, that thing sucks. Propane. Mm. I need half masks. I could just... I need to get out. Well, that was a stupid raid. <laughs> I came with just a little pistol looking for a car extract that came out with a whole pilgrim full of random shit. This is a dumb haul, but it worked out. Scavs up. 308. Man, this, this raid took forever to load in. It was like seven minutes. I like it's not forever. When the, and when Wipe first started, it was everything was like 15 minutes for a scav. I guess it's not too bad. Stupid helmet, man. I hate that helmet. Any level 1 helmet with covers your ears, what's the point of that? If it doesn't cover your ears, that's just because you're broke and you're using it. Man, you'd never use those. They cover your ears. They're so annoying. I think they're in there. I'm just gonna loot it. To be honest, I never looted this building. I don't think I've even been in here. Oh, never mind. Yeah, I have. <laughs> I've just never gone through there. Doesn't look like there's much to loot. All just space. Oh, it's because there's locked doors, that's why. ETR. Cool. I like that thing. I want more moving stuff. Dynamic, I guess, is the better word. I know they added it this map. You can like tear down walls with grenade launchers and grenades. I've never seen it done. I don't even know where you can use it. I think I've seen one clip of it happening on wipe day, but that was it. Not even wipe day, it was probably like a day or two after. Gas analyzer. No, oh, that's cool, I guess. I need gas analyzers, though. What the fuck was that? Was that the BTR's gun? Oh, well. Airdrop. And we're out. Huh. Fancy looking. I'll keep it. I mean, I tried Lighthouse. Might as well go... Streets or interchange? I'm gonna go interchange. Oh, okay. I feel like this is gonna be really hard to get to it from there because I'm pretty sure people spawn in between here and the car extract. I push a talk. I need to talk to people. Dude, his hatchet running. I thought he might have been going for the car extract. Man, you've got to be kidding me if the car is not here. That's three raids in a row. No car. No car. Man, that's so stupid. Like a hole in the fence. <sighs> hey, mate. How you doing? Hello. It's the second time he ran to it and just ran away. I don't know what he's doing. Quick raid. That was dumb. I'm going back in the interchange. I say I should do a night raid, but they're all the same, really. I'll do a day raid. I'll do a night raid, because I just did a day. I'll switch it up every time, you know. Alright, try number two. Hopefully we get it. Should he spawn? Actually, no, actually pretty good. Should have spawned on it, but... Yeah. Next best thing. I thought I joined a... Oh no, this is a night raid. There's no car again! What the fuck is this, man? I'm gonna call that scav. Oh, you can hop over that quick. What the- f 
I didn't see him at all. There was one left. I swear I heard it left, but I went to check right anyways, but there was another. Whatever. It's dark. Can't see shit. That's fine. <laughs>